Alexa Pano has done it. The first year tour member has won the ISPS Hand the World Invitational for her first LPGA tour title. And what a way to do it on her birthday, no less. I'm Adam Stanley, and this is LPGA Now. Let's get into it. Pano, the 19-year-old rookie, fired a tournament low 6 under 66 on Sunday to finish at 8 under after 72 holes, tied with Esther Honsolet and 54-hole leader Gabriella Cowley. Pano's final round finished with a flurry with back-to-back -back birdies on numbers 17 and 18. The LPGA Tour's latest team sensation. Pano tapped in for the win on the final playoff hole, defeating Cowley on the third extra frame. Pano said the moment immediately following her win was hard to process. I mean, I've been dreaming of this for so long, even just putts on the practice screen saying this is to win an LPGA event. And to finally have that putt and have that opportunity, it just exceeded my expectations and it was so much fun. And funny enough, Pano didn't even have her clubs or her luggage when she landed earlier in the week. An interesting start to the week, but the best kind of finish. I mean, especially when I landed, it felt like, wow, this is gonna be an interesting week. But um, obviously it turned out to be really good, so I wouldn't change a thing looking back now. Ponsolet shot a three under 69 Sunday, while Cowley shot a two under 70. She had a sizzling finish, however, making birdie on number 17 and an eagle on number 18 to close out her day. It remains to be seen if this will be a coming out party for Pano, who first rose to fame in the 2012 documentary, The Short Game. But as the youngest winner on tour this season, it gave her heaps of confidence. Be sure to follow along as the LPGA Tour heads to Canada next week, where Paula Rito looks to successfully defend her title at the CPKC Women's Open in Vancouver, British Columbia.